So last video, I, I was talking about how to uh, start work, how I how I started working out and how you can too. And uh, this video, I'm going to be talking about being consistent and um, general lifestyle changes you should make. And um, I took my earbuds, so I'm not talking too loud. Uh, Yeah. Anyways, so I got, uh, it's horizontal now, the video is horizontal now, and now I have two logs instead of one shitty log that, uh, fell, fell down the hill. So, uh, hopefully that's more presentable and, uh, you know, a little bit more professional than before. But, uh, what are we talking about? How to be consistent. So, how to work out consistently and other lifestyle changes, I'll make this into sections. This first part will be uh, me not knowing what the video is about, so that's cool. Um, so I started working out three weeks ago, I think. I think this is my third week of working out again. Um, I do have better genetics than most people, so like I have like veins and stuff and whatever but I'm still small and skinny and I, I'm on my bulking journey for a year and all that, or however long it takes, you know, but uh, get into that into a different video. But today what I wanna be focusing about is consistency. And I did uh, three day push pull legs, or three days a week push pull legs for two weeks. And then, you know, that sort of like got me back into it. Uh, I never really was consistent before, uh, more than like, a month or, or so like I only made it like a month of being consistent I was just like working out when I felt like it but uh, now I work out uh, at the same time every day I wrap four o'clock ish um, and I try to end around five five thirty uh, and then I do I, I like I might take a quick shower or I might you know do do a chore that I have if it makes me sweat again like mowing I'll do that before showering and then I'll do my homework and all that and whatever, go to bed, eat dinner and stuff. But, um, I, so I, back to, uh, working out, I worked out for two weeks, three days, push pull legs, three days a week, two weeks, push pull legs. There we go. Um, and then just this last week, today's Monday, uh, that I'm recording. So just this last week I did six day push pull legs. And uh, I worked till failure on all of my stuff, or close to failure on all my stuff. Um, and ev every week, make sure to like increase your reps and so you can see progression. And also like between each workout, uh, have like a one to three minute break, you know, so you can rest and promotes more muscle growth. Um, eat lots of protein. If you're bulking, eat around 200 to 300 calories over your usual. So you, like I, I just got this uh, MyFitnessPal or something like that. Uh, it's my, I just use that to track my calories and you can also track your weight on that, but there's whole premium stuff. I don't have the premium. And then, um, shit, I forgot. Yeah, how to stay consistent. Basically, just do it at the same time every day, every week. Like you, like um, for example, you, you got your you got your workout. Uh, I do it at four o'clock personally, around four o'clock. I do it at four o'clock every day. I do my five minute warm up, cardio, whatever that is. I just go on a five minute run. Then uh, I have it like loops perfectly t at my pace to where I get back home in five minutes. And I do my run and then I do my workout one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, taking a three minute break in between each one. I'd like watch Hamza videos or stuff like that or uh, work on my Bible plan uh, in between for my breaks. And also like take sips of water, don't chug your water, you know, while you're resting. And, um, Make sure to have, like, 
I, I right now I'm, I'm resting every Sunday. So Sunday is my day rest. I work six days for the week uh, on my workout. And um, this video is five minutes long. My video, my last video was like five minutes long. I'm probably gonna make this one like 10 or eight or something. I don't know. I'm just gonna talk until uh, I do this thing where I blank out again. Um, so, let me think real quick. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, lifestyle changes. Um, the recent lifestyle changes I've made is, uh, I've been eating, like, I, I eat at least four eggs for breakfast every day, uh, and then, you know, like, I, I usually have more eggs, but I have, like, eggs for breakfast, you know, I try to get some sort of, like, healthy, balanced lunch. I mean, I have school lunches, so it's really hard, but I try to get the healthiest thing there. Eventually, I'll just start making my own meals. I think that's the best thing to do, is just make your own meals and make, make get, make healthy meals, you know. Um, I've also, like, stopped, like, just consuming sugar just load like I used to consume loads of sugar like I used to drink pop like whenever like whenever I had the chance to get pop I would drink pop I call it pop because I'm from the north but that's whatever and um like anything sugary like a dessert or something I would just indulge on it without like giving a fuck about it and you shouldn't be doing that you know so now I've been really reduced I I did have two tiny little cookies yesterday, and I regret that, now that I think about that. Um, yeah, don't eat sugar. Uh, you know, natural sugar and fruit and stuff is fine. Just try not to eat processed stuff. Don't try to make, try to get like, if you have like a bunch of like, you know, cheap ass pl plastic utensil, utensils or plastic, like plastic spatula or whatever, stuff, stuff like that, plastics, try to get metal or I don't know if metal's good but like wood wood is really good if you can like find wooden versions of those objects I have not done that yet but um I probably will soon and um I have to go eat dinner pretty soon so I think I'm gonna cut the video right here bye